Hey everyone, today's episode is for you if you're looking for a budget buy and you're looking for a single wide mobile home like this one here that is listed for $7,900 and then there's this one here that is $5,000 or there's this one here that's $1,400. These are the homes we're looking at today along with a few others. So grab your coffee, grab a tea, or you can grab that cocktail because we're in the state of Florida today on the gorgeous Gulf Coast and these homes are all $9,900 or less. It's great to see everyone. Again, how's everybody out there doing today? Wherever you guys are, hope you're having a wonderful day and I hope that cup is full of happiness. Okay, so today's video is for those of you looking for a budget buy. You're okay with a single wide mobile home and you wanna spend under $10,000 to get it. You may have to roll up your sleeves and get your hands dirty with these, so just an FYI for you guys. So we're gonna start right here on the price points of $9,900 and work our way down to that $1,400 cutie. Okay, so we're gonna begin right here. Now this one is in Lakeland, so if there, for those of you who wanna get away from the water, away from the coast, but you're still not gonna be too far from it, this is a little cutie. It's 480 square feet of space. This one's been on the market for 55 days. It's $9,900. And they don't tell us what year it is, so let's take a look. I'm guessing by the exterior, it's a late 50s model, maybe early 60s. So let's see what we get for our money. Super cute. If you've watched my channel at all and you're one of my subs, you know, you guys, I love these older single homes. They're strong as tanks. And this one's really sweet because it does have this really large screen lanai right on the side of it. You do have a pad here in the front. Looks like you might have a little bit of parking on the side. Looks like you do have some privacy. We'll see if there's a neighbor on that right side there. Look at this, this is really cute. So you have a window AC unit there, you've got laminated flooring, you've got an electric stove, the refrigerator, white in color, so it's matching. You've got really cute cabinets. I like how they're vented in uh, here at the top. Those are kind of nice. So you've got a white blank palette, you've got really big windows. They don't look like they have cranks on them. Very, very cute. Okay, this looks to be like maybe one of the, that's the bedroom there. There's your closet. There's your electrical panel. So there's a little bit better view of the lanai. And must be they're not gonna show us. Okay, so here you're almost to the curve. So you do have a neighbor, but they're kind of a diagonal set in there diagonally, so that's kind of nice. That is super cute. I mean, there's a lot that you could do with landscaping here. That is really adorable. $9,900, and this gives you a better, a little bit of a view of the park. Very colorful, I like it. And there, it looks like they're mostly all singles here. Okay, and that's another view. Got a nice tree there. Very, very cute. Okay, this one is located at 2245 New Tampa Highway, Lot 22, in Lakeland, Florida, 33815. It is located in a quiet, convenient, located community. The price is right. You can move in and make it your own. And this is Pine Grove Estates in the heart of Lakeland. And let me see here, I do have a Pine Grove open here and it says here that the lot rent can be anywhere from 225 to 275, that's what one of them says. And then this one says 400 to 600 a month. So again, as I mentioned in many of my videos, it's best to call the community of interest and ask direct questions about what their lot rent currently is, how often it goes up. Sometimes these communities will raise their lot rents in the middle of summer, like July 1st, and some will raise their lot rents January 1st. And if you have a pet to consider, you're gonna to have to ask about the pet policy, so on and so forth. But nonetheless, this is $9,900 in Lakeland, Florida, 33815, and it's been on the market for 55 days. Let's see if there's any, no history. Could be somebody's lived there a long time. Okay, moving on from there, let's check out this one. This is another $9,900 single. This has 624 square feet. This is a two bedroom, one bath. This is a 69 mobile home. It's been on the market 140 days. So let's see what we get for $9,900. Super cute on the outside. Now this, you've got the carport and the little pad here in the front. You have an enclosed Florida room. You have the awning over the window. 
Do you have a railing there? You could put window boxes up here, a window box on the front. This one's super cute too. You're a little closer to your neighbors with this one. Of course, if you didn't have this here, you'd have a little more space, but nice carport nonetheless. Okay, so there's the side. So there's your little side entry. This would be the entrance to the storage room. So there's that Florida room. Looks like it has tongue and groove on the interior. That's pretty nifty. That could be painted. You could remove the drapes, put cordless blinds in there. You could have, you could put a mini split in there for your AC or a vertical unit and vent it out the end. There's your laundry room. This is a good size storage room. Look at that. Wow. It's a lot of space right there. There's a lot we could do with that. Okay, so here is the kitchen. How cute is this? Oh my goodness, that's adorable. Look at this pendant light. So you have vinyl flooring. You do have some blue carpet. This one has a ton of potential. Look at this, you guys. For you budget finders out there, budget seekers, this has a lot of potential. So you do have a little bit of a breakfast bar on the other side of the sink. You've got your electric stove. You do have ventilation behind it with this vintage vent. Then you do have what looks like the light on the range hood. Really pretty cabinets. $9,900. Now here's your paneling on the interior. It is typical with these single mobile homes, these older units. Then you have a window AC unit there. Again, you could put a mini split in. That looks like it's the bedroom. You could remove that carpet immediately. Okay, now remember the hallways are not the widest. So if you have an assisting um, anything to help with your walking, you definitely want to measure the hallway. And when you're there in person, you can walk these homes, you can walk the halls, check the flooring beneath the commode, check the electric panel, so on and so forth, check your AC unit, your plumbing pipes, and uh, you can also have a home inspection. There is the other bedroom, there's the closet. Okay. You could put louver doors on, you could take this all out and open it right up uh, and remove the heavy drapes. It does have another window there. And there is the bathroom. Look how large the bathroom is. That vinyl flooring probably lasts forever. You've got a single shower, which is really nice. You do have an assist handle there. Really long vanity. I love those vanity doors. This one is super retro and it is super, super full of potential. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense, but look how cute this is. All right, so moving on to this room. It does have the ceiling fan there. There's another AC unit there. Okay, and there is the rear side, there's that big storage room. Looks like a very nice nice location. Welcome to Northgate Mobile Home and RV Park. It's a 55 plus park. Okay, let's see what the deets say. So again, it's a 69 model. It's been on the market for 140 days, you guys. It's $9,900. It's a Northgate, it's a 55 active adult park. And it does say here that the lot rent is $530 a month. You can't have a rental that is not permitted. And let, trying to see if it says anything about pets. I don't see anything about, oh yes. Um, you says they do have a pet policy. So you'd have to ask the community, you know, about that if you are, if you are moving with a pet, but that is really cute. Nonetheless, $9,900. $9, it was listed in November of last year for 24. Then it was reduced, 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 and now they're down to 9,900, which tells me they are motivated to part ways. That is, that's a really nice unit for that kind of money. Okay, and that is at 3315 6th Avenue, Mims, Florida, 32714. So let's just see where Mims, Florida is real quick. For those of us who are not familiar with that location, Okay, Mims, Florida is here on the Atlantic coast. You're probably a couple of hours from Orlando. Oops, sorry about that. And so we are right here, Mims, Florida. Very beautiful location. And that is for this home right here for $9,900. So if you guys wanna be on the Atlantic coast, I'd say that is a good one to be looking closer, getting a closer view. Um, all right, so let's move on to this one here. Sorry guys. Coffee's really kicking in. <laughs> My apologies. Okay, so this one is a $9,000 find in Leesburg, Florida, 34748, 1208 Lee Street, Lot 90 in Leesburg. That's a lot of L's. This one's only been on the market for six days. So let's see what we get for $9,000 in Leesburg. Very nice exterior. 
does have an AC window unit there on the side. A lot you could do with the front with landscaping. There's your carport. Here is the kitchen. So let's see, this one does have a wall unit for your oven. You've got upgraded cabinets, it looks like. Those certainly are not originals. You do have carpet and you have vinyl. Okay, so this is the heavy overhead cabinet. This could be removed. I've seen it done many times. And then you could actually make this a little bit wider and have more of a counter height, counter height for your two bar chairs there. Carpet could be removed. It looks like it should be removed. There is an AC unit there. These are the crank windows. There's your paneling with a lot of built-in drawers there. Six built-in drawers and the deep closet. That's a really, those are great space savers. More vinyl flooring. This is definitely gonna be one that you'd wanna fix up and put the lid down. Okay, so this is a big shower. Nonetheless, you've got hardwood cabinet doors in the bathroom, more vinyl flooring. And this gives you a little view of the community. So they are updating the community. More than likely, these are communities that have these older homes. Maybe somebody's lived there for a long time. Maybe they just had a lot rent increase. Again, that's why we call the communities to ask specifics. And uh, they are now selling it and put it on the market for $9,000 in Leesburg, Florida. Leesburg is not far. It's basically right smack dab in the middle of the state. If you want to see where Leesburg, Florida is, we will put that in here. Okay. Let's see where we are here. Show you a better version of Leesburg right here on the map. We are right here. So you are northwest of Orlando. So you're closer to Spring Hill, Crystal River, Homosassa, here's Cedar Key. You're not far from the Atlantic coast, but you're definitely closer to the Gulf. There is Leesburg. Not a bad little buy there, you guys, for $9,000. And it's a one bedroom, one bath handyman special. And let's see here. Springs, yeah, you are very close to the natural springs that I've spoke about in my past videos. And they are 72 degrees year round. Beautiful, beautiful um, um, areas in the natural springs. You're close to the Suwannee River, the Santa Fe River. This one is on the shores of Lake Griffin. And uh, so it does have some amenities. Let's see if there's any history. No, no history with this one. And let's see if we can see, let's see, this is Lakeside Village. And it does say here the lot rent is $565 per month to $654. So again, call the community and ask specifics on that lot rent. But nonetheless, you guys, it's a $9,000 home, single mobile home. Alrighty, moving on from that one. This one is one that was in the intro for $7,900. This one has 663 square feet. This is a one bedroom, one bath in Lakeland, Florida, 33815. This is a 1966 model. What are we getting for $7,900? The outside really does not look too terrible at all. This you could do a lot with um, the front for landscaping. This does need to be corrected though because it does not look like the screening that pest control companies place on these homes or you could do it yourself if you're handy. Uh, this would definitely need to be fixed because you definitely want tight screening with very, very tight squares so pests cannot get beneath the home and it doesn't look like it has that. That's first and foremost, in my opinion. You do have your screen lanai, you've got the carport with your storage shed, nice driveway. Here's the inside, cool looking cabinets. You've got a double door refrigerator, vinyl flooring. Ceiling looks nice and white and clean. Not a huge kitchen, but you could, you know, modify that. Here is your living room. There's another window AC unit, more vinyl flooring. They do have crank windows. And then there's one of the bedrooms with another AC unit, more vinyl flooring. Looks like it does have a closet on each side, which is nice. Here's your retro bathroom, elongated vanity. You do have a nice step-in shower there with an assist handle. This looks like it could be vinyl flooring also. And here is a glimpse into the community with a lot of tiki huts. Looks like a little putt-putt range. And there's your pool, it looks very nice. So more than likely, this is one of those communities where they're sprucing it up and maybe it was an elderly person or somebody could no longer afford the lot rent. Maybe it's had an increase or maybe the community was just purchased. That happens a lot. Nonetheless, it is $7,900 with 663 square feet. And that again is a 66 model. And this one is a one bedroom, one bathroom. As we see, 
It's a 55 adult community holiday park, and the lot rent here is $7.57 per month. It includes your water, your sewer, your trash, and the pass on tax. And uh, so holiday park, and this is in Lakeland, Florida. Any history with it? It was listed in December for $12.5, and now they're down to $7,900. So more than likely, they are, you know, very motivated, hopefully. And so at $7,900 at 12 months, you are looking at about $9,000 a year to reside in that home for your lot rent. And then, of course, you're going to have Florida Power for your electric bill. And if you want cable, it would be Xfinity, Comcast for your cable and Wi-Fi. So not a bad little buy, $7,900, you guys. Okay, so moving on from there. We're moving on to this one here, and this one is in Winter Haven, Florida, 33881, 210 Parakeet Avenue. And this is a $5,000 budget buy. What are we getting for $5,000? This is a one-bedroom, one-bath home, and looks to be the same on the bottom. It needs that screening for the pests. That's first and foremost. This is adorable, though. Okay, so this one looks like it does have the screen lanai along the side. Okay, there's your washer and dryer. There's the kitchen. So it looks like the kitchen was a little updated. Do you have a new stove? Looks like there is a stainless sink, some cabinets, cabinets overhead, vinyl flooring. There's the living room. This is definitely an older model. Look at these windows. Very vintage. And there is the bathroom there. There is your spout for your shower. <laughs> you do have the tub and shower combination. This would probably need an assist handle. And there looks to be a bedroom. Okay, this is Lake Deer Mobile Hamlet Adult 55 Community here. And this one, again, is 210 Parakeet Avenue, one bedroom, one bath, hot off the listing press. And it does uh, great low maintenance, one, one home, spacious screen room to enjoy the Florida weather. The home has no major structural concerns. It's priced to sell, $5,000. No history on it either. And this one is in Lake Deer Mobile Home Hamlet, which some of these ads say that it is $8.25 a month. Then another one says it's four something per month. So again, it's best to call the community of interest. Now, it also depends on where the home is situated in these parks. So the lot rent can, you know, it can vary from location to location. So that again is something that you'd want to call and ask for specifics. But $5,000 nonetheless, you guys, and it really, it's really adorable. So there is another one. Okay, moving on to this $1,400 super single, you guys. $1,400. It's going to be interesting to see what we get for our money. And this one is at 255 North Tamimi Trail, Unit 74 in Nokomis, Florida, 34275. Nokomis is my neighbor. And this one is a 1965 model, $1,400. Now we see there is an awning over the front windows. You have a landscape box here in the front. And this, like the other one, is going to need that pest control screening along the whole base of it. Does not have a carport, as we see here. It does have the pad. And let's see, any history for this one? No history. So let's see what we're getting for $1,400. Okay, so there is the one side of it. And here we see there is an issue on the rear wall. You have two AC window units. That is going to need some attention. Do you have palm trees around the whole outside of it? And here is the interior. Okay, so you have cab you no know cabinet, lower cabinet doors in the kitchen. Looks like it does have a drop-in sink, laminated flooring. You do have the crank windows with this house, and we have serious issues in the ceiling, more than likely an issue with the roof. So again, when you get in there and you can inspect this home in person, you can have a home inspector with you and have the whole thing inspected, but we can see with the naked eye that it definitely has a ceiling issue. So the home more than likely would need a new roof. Depending on how long it is, a new roof could be put on, but you definitely want to rip this all out there because you certainly wouldn't want to live with black mold or anything else like that. But this is why it's priced at $1,400. Okay, so this is in Palm and Pines. And it's a one bedroom, one bath, $1,400. And you can schedule a private tour, well-maintained community, which is owned by Lakeshore Communities, which purchased this community along with their sister property, Happy Haven, several years ago. And from what I remember, the management telling me a few, it was probably over a month ago now, because I called about another home that they have in there for $8,800, which they told me was sold, but it's still on realtor.com. 
They are pet friendly and their lot rent there is $7.65 per month. So for $7.65 a month, you're paying $9,180 a year to live inside this community. It is a very small community. There are not very many homes in there. And if you're traveling from Sarasota, from Siesta Key, you're about 25 minutes or so, depending on traffic. It's going to be on the west side. You are five minutes from Nokomis Beach. And uh, it's a very love thy neighbor community, very small community. They might have shuffleboard, but they're not going to have any other any other amenities. And uh, so, yeah, you got to have to be ready to be pulling in there because it's right off of Tammy Trail 41. So it's kind of a busy location but it's a quaint, quiet park nonetheless. And you could ask the management if you are allowed to remove this home and place a new single in there. This community, from what I recall, does not have any double wides. They do have RV pads also. And, uh, and I do know that they have new single homes in this community that they've had advertised in the past as rentals and for sale. So if you don't wanna fix this home up and maybe you wanna move in a single wide mobile home, you can definitely call Palm and Pines and ask them if they allow that. You never know, right? So it's $1,400 nonetheless for a fixer for the single 65 mobile home in Nokomis 40, you guys. So there will be the conclusion of today's episode. All of these, you know, under $9,900. You never know what you're gonna get until you get a closer view. And if you're new here, you guys, you're welcome to subscribe to the channel. This is where we venture through uh, state to state, through town to town to see just how much house or home we can get for our money. And today, these were under $9,900 single wide mobile homes in the beautiful state of Florida. Hope you have a great day wherever you are. Keep those cups full of happiness. And until next time, stay safe, stay aware, and definitely stay tuned. Cheers, everybody. Have a great day.